Hello and welcome back. So today we're going through more items that have been kindly sent into the PO Box. I'm on a bit of a recording spree. This will be my third PO Box opening in the row. So for those of you uh, that are concerned, the Benjamin Bunny giveaway has already been drawn uh, weeks ago now. Um, the, I have pre-recorded these PO Box videos prior to drawing that winner to make sure that everyone that sent in their postcards as entry into that PO Box uh, giveaway prize uh, does get included into it. So I've got a stack of... of uh, postcards that weeks and weeks ago were all entered into the drawer you would have seen them going into the bag hopefully that's how i end up recording it um but i'm just getting through the last of the backlog i think this is going to be the last one and then we're all up to date so apologies if you sent something in recently there's a bit of a backlog that i'm working through <laughs> but uh, thank you for your patience and thank you for writing into the peer box so those of you that want to write into the peer box the address is as follows it is Christopher Collect, PO Box 6996, Basingstoke, RG244, JF. Uh, and if you go to the links to write into the PO Box, feel free to plug your website, your social media, your YouTube channel. I'm more than happy to give you a plug if you go to the links to write into my PO Box. Equally, if you enclose an envelope with a stamp and your address on it, I'll be sure to reply to you as well. But without further ado, let's get into the first one, which is this one. So it says... Hi Christopher, my name is Rio and I'm 10 years old. Uh, you might remember me from my mum telling you that I found a Q Gardens 50p and a... Oh yes, I remember you, the video you sent me, that was amazing. Um, altogether I found five complete Olympic sets. I found 460 <laughs> Olympics, 25 WWF 50ps and 119 Glasgow Commonwealths. I gave away some of them to fellow collectors but I did keep the Q Gardens. I'm back out coin hunting to find my seventh Olympic set, I have sent you one of the Olympics that I found in the hunt from Rio Jenkins. I remember seeing you sitting in the video thinking, holy Toledo, that is the hunt of a lifetime. I've never known someone to get that many coins. It was unbelievable. A whole dining room table covered in Olympics. And then you caught the little, the, your face when you found that Q Gardens was just phenomenal. <laughs> An unboxing 50 feet. Thank you so much, Rio. That has absolutely made my day. Next up, we've got this letter. So it says, Dear Christopher, my name is Harry. I am 10 years old, uh, but by the time you read this, I am probably 11. Well, happy 11th birthday. Uh, you are my second uh, favourite uh, YouTuber. Uh, after Half a Sleep Chris, oh, I don't blame you. Half a Sleep Chris makes phenomenal videos um, with a lot more editing and the stop-go motion is amazing. So I don't blame you for putting me in second place. I would put myself in second place <laughs> in a competition between myself and Half a Sleep Chris. Uh, it says, did you hear about his cat, Tom? I did, it was very, and I was very sorry to hear that. As a, Are you a cat person or a dog person? I'm a cat person, I love cats. And my heart goes out to half a sleep, Chris, for his, uh, his loss of his cat. It's never easy, never easy. Um, half Sleep Chris has actually led me to your channel. I was looking up Sherlock Holmes 50p and I found you. Uh, so thank you to Half Sleep Chris then. Uh, I was also your hour made me start collecting coins. The first coin I got was the gunpowder plot and the second coin I got was the E for English breakfast holy Toledo what a find that is E for English breakfast I found I found it going to be English flag I thought you're going to oh, I thought it was going to be E for English flag um, here is a double of one of my coins that I would like you to have from Harry ah We've got an active union. Well, thank you so much, Harry. That's very, very kind of you. And I'm, it's amazing that you found me through Half Sleep, Chris. I'm well chuffed with that. Next up, we've got this one. We've got a postcard for the Benjamin Bunny giveaway and an ominously wrapped tinfoil package. We sell everything you can imagine on eBay. Well, there we go. Hmm. Note read first. It says, Dear Christopher Collects. Uh, hi, my name is James and I love, uh, uh, and I have been collecting for about two months or maybe three when you get this letter. <laughs> I am uh, so grateful to you. All your amazing videos are and generous giveaways make me keep going and collecting all the 50p's and two pounds. My Discord name is James underscore SP22. I recognize your, your name. Uh, and I will probably 
have my YouTube channel by the time you get this letter. And my YouTube is Collectible Cash. That's a cool name, I like that. Uh, uh, thanks for making uh, amazing videos and I enclose coins that are listed below. Commemorative one euro, one commemorative two euro. Uh, one cura, one cura, one cura. Bird, bear, fish, one cura. P.S. I'm from Britain, but I didn't have any better coins I could send. Sorry, I don't, don't apologize. <laughs> Just the fact that you've written in absolutely is amazing. Uh, P.P.P.S. The card has my eBay account name. Oh, I see, I'm with you. Wow, wait. Well, these are wrapped up nice and securely. I must admit, I was a bit worried with the big tin foil <laughs> package. I was wondering what was going to be in there. But thank you so much for these. They are amazing. Oh, there's the bear and the bird. Wow. Well, James, thank you very, very much. And I believe, if you're the person I think you are from Discord, that we actually met at the Royal Mint, which is awesome. I think that I signed your postcard and your sister's postcard. Uh, so it was amazing meeting you if that was you. Uh, and thank you very much. Next up we have this one. It says, Dear Christopher Collect, I watch your YouTube videos and your live streams on Sundays. I started collecting two pound coins because my grandma uh, had a whole whiskey bottle of them. We got common ones, but we got two 2015 Britannias, one Wales Commonwealth Games, uh, Ireland Commonwealth Games, wow. Uh, so here are 2000 pennies. I got five Qs in change, no way at Tesco's, holy Toledo. There we go, Q Gardens 50p. Is that Nottingham, one pound coin? And English breakfast there, wow. And an Australian 50 cents, that's amazing. And a penny from the year 2000. So I'll pop that in the pot and I'll pop you in the boards. Thank you very, very much. And there we go, Finley, thank you. Next up, we've got this one. It says, dear Christopher, I'm a big fan of your videos and have found an interest in finding out about coins. I know you like stamps too, so I've included an almost complete pack of 95 German stamps. Wow. Um, I have a son, a passion of half pennies and one penny coins. I did have a spare 50p and an unknown coin too. My main interest is in coinery is spoons and pencils uh, my oh l uh lol f oliver wow well look at that what does it say interlaken oh a rolex a rolex food how cool is that me in the shot there I can't tell <laughs> how cool is that a Rolex spoon very very cool seal stamps oh wow look at these oh they're coil stamps wow look at these Well, they are very, very cool. Thank you so much for them. And for the, I think we've got a thumbnail here. Someone sent me a Rolex. <laughs> but thank you so much, Oliver. That's very, very cool of you. Next up, we've got this one. It says, to Christopher Collects. I just started coin collecting a couple of weeks ago. Watching your videos and streams really inspired me. Thank you. Uh, do you have any tips for coin collecting? Uh, my, my tips are never go up, keep going. That's the only way you'll guarantee you'll find the coins you're after. And tell everyone you know you're collecting coins. The more people you've got looking out for you, the better. Head on over to Change Checker as well if you want information on UK coins, especially the vintage figures they've got. Their scarcity index is like a pyramid. The rarest ones are on top, most common ones at the bottom. I had screenshots of those on my phone until I learned what was rare and what wasn't rare. If you're looking at world coins, you can go no better than New Mister. Um, head on over there. It's got a mass. They've got a massive database of coins. Um, that's my advice. Uh, so far in my collection, I have uh, rare 20p, 450ps, and seven foreign coins, and eight two pound coins. Congratulations on 40k subscribers. Well done. Well, thank you very much. 
Um, I've got you a few foreign coins. There is my address on the back. Please, can you send me a rare pound coin, if possible, 10p coin and 5p? I thank you for inspiring me to collect coins from Stephen, age 12. P.S. Address on the other side. Look, it's a Doctor Who one. Very cool. And there we go. We've got. Is that a Greek euro? Uh, a euro. A Spanish euro? I'm not very good with my euros, I must admit. And a Polish grosh. Well, thank you very much, Stephen. Next up, we've got this one. I have to cover the corner because there's an address there. Oh, there we go. There's the note. It says. Hello Christopher, I've sent you a few coins for your collection, hopefully some of them you haven't got yet. I have enjoyed your coin hunt videos and your world coin hunts videos as well. Thank you, they're one of my favourite ones to do. Um, I'll be sending more to you in the next few weeks. Hope you like the ones I've sent you for now. Regards, Martin C. Holy Toledo, look at all these. These are very, very cool. I must admit, banknotes, I don't really know what I'm looking at, but these are very, very cool. And they look in amazing condition as well. 5,000 lie, lay, I love the colours on that. Oh, that's a beautiful design, isn't it? Oh man, oh man, oh man. These are so, so cool, especially, look at the colours. Where did you get all these from? I don't even know how I would go about getting banknotes like this. Honduras. Wow. Amazing. Thank you so much for all of them. Wow, wait, what is this? One st United States Liberty coin. Half dollar. Wowee! So we've got 1986 Liberty. Look at the packaging it's in. Oop! I hope that's supposed to come out like that. How cool is that? Wow, look at this. This sort of protective packaging. I imagine it's supposed to stay in that. And then. Florida. What is this? Vatican. Oregon. This is Vatican again. Wow, these are so, so cool. And then a whole bunch more. Look at that, that's gorgeous. Look at these, they're like proof versions. That's absolutely amazing. And then a whole bunch of these awesome looking older coins as well. Half oh, of these I don't even recognize. One rupee from India, wow. You see the date on it was 18 something as well. Chimney Christmas, these are something else. Like, look at that, half crown. Yeah, half crown, 1921. Holy Toledo. 10 German Deutsche Mark. Look at that. Greek. 1863, 1963. Wow. Unbelievable stuff. That's very, very cool. And there's even more. These are so cool. Look at that, palm trees. Look at the shape of this one. Wowee. Amazing. Well, Martin, a massive thank you for all of them. I am, I cannot wait to have a look through them and get more information about them in my treasures from the PO Box videos. Thank you so much. I've got three more and then we're all up to date, ready for the Benjamin Bunny giveaway says, hello Christo, Christo, <laughs> I like it, a Cristol, hello Cristol, 
Uh, a few coins for your collection enclosed, some more interesting than others. No Y2K penny. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but I've been looking out, I'm guessing which one might stand out to you. If it's a match, the prize is pizza, no pineapple. <laughs> Who is this? Um, don't leave that in your PO box long. Maybe more coins instead. I live close to the Royal Mint, so maybe see you someday. Keep up the good work on your very informative channel. It's helped me out a lot. All the best, Ben Thomas. P.S. You might have answered this, but what music do you use on your videos? It is... The airport lounge, PTO. I some, sometimes I hear it in my sleep, as you might. Only the key change never stops, and by morning it's really high. I hope you decide to. I hope you don't decide to change it though. I like that baseline. I'm never going to change the, the music on my videos. I have no intention. Uh, I absolutely love it. But Ben Thomas, thank you so much, Ben. We've got a whole bunch of awesome looking coins. Holy Toledo, look at all these. So what's gonna stand out to me? Look at that, old penny from 1915. That's an odd looking half penny. Quite beaten up. But I want to win pizza. <laughs> 1910 penny. This is it, ninja, oh it's pizza is the prize. Teenage Ninja Mutant Ninja. Mega Turtles. What are they called? Leonardo. I can never remember it. Teenage Turtle Mutant Ninjas. Teenage Mutant Turtle Ninjas. Teenage. I didn't watch Teenage Turtle People <laughs> as a kid. My friend had the um, the game on one of the old consoles, and I loved playing it. But I never watched the TV show. I must admit. But these are amazing. So a massive thank you for all of these. That's absolutely amazing and look at Jurassic World Tetley token unbelievable thank you so much penultimate envelope is this one it says dear Christopher I have been collecting for four months now and your channel has kept me collecting I hope you won't get stuck on the Olympic wrestling again oh me too me too um, my collection has done really well and I have and I hope book three does too. As for two pounds, I hope you get on to book four. Me too. <laughs> I don't want you to stop and you should keep on going. I hope you start finding more 2019 10Ps to fill that book. I've also made you a cardboard coin holder that holds a 50p. I've also found Commonwealth Games England. Wow. 10 year 2000 pennies. I don't think this needs explaining. Well, look at that picture. That is amazing. Absolutely amazing from uh, Ryan, uh, Ryan Horsfield, uh, nine years old, best channel ever, and subscribed. Thank you so much. Look at that. Amazing. Let's have a look then. I must, I must have a 50p to hand somewhere. Whoops. I think I just popped a bubble in the um, jiffy bag. So I've got a Christopher Ryan side. There we go. How snazzy does that look? Well, a Christopher inside. Christopher, fellow Christopher, in the book. Thank you very much. Wowee. Well, thank you so much, Ryan. I will pop these in the pot and I'll get your name on the board. And last, but by no means least, we have this one here. Holy Toledo. That is a lot of information to take in right there. It says, Dear Christopher Collect, thank you for all the great videos. Everyone loves uh, your, my favorite YouTuber because you respond to comments and of others don't. I got some coins, uh, enjoy. I got you a mystery uh, token and see-through box of pennies that make a picture if you connect them. I would really appreciate it if you would make a video of them commenting. Keep up the good work. I really love the videos and would love a shout out. Love from Fulden, uh, Fletcher, Fletcher, AKA coin collecting cat. <laughs> what a cool name. Uh, you should do more battles with Chains Checker. Hope you will win them. Uh, what's your favorite 50p Mines Q Gardens? Mine I'm not quite sure how long that has not been recorded for. Hopefully not too long. Uh, it says, what is your favourite 50p? Mine's Q Guns. Mine's um, Isaac Newton. Favourite £2 coin? 
yours is Charles Dickens. Mine is um, Frankenstein from Coin Collecting Cat. Wowee, well, where do we even start? We've got Star Wars Match Attacks. How cool are they? I didn't even realize they did them. Very cool. And Finn, amazing. Uh, we've got a whole assortment of coins, modern, old. Thank you so much for all of these, that's amazing. We've got some chocolates to keep the energy levels high. Oh, I'm not reading the instructions. One, read letter. Two, open see-through box. Open see-through box. Three, look at coins. We looked at the coins. Oh, this is what I'm gonna make the shield out of, right? Okay, right. How's that? We've made the shield. Four, open mystery. Open mystery. Is this the mystery? <laughs> We've got very corroded something there. Don't recognise it. Some teeny tiny little one oars. A shilling. A penny from the year 2000. Half penny and Paddington at the cathedral. Wowie. Well, coin collecting cat. Thank you so much. I apologise I didn't read your instructions first. We got that a bit haphazard, but uh, thank you very much for all your very very kind gifts. Well, as ever, all that can all that I'm left with is to thank very kindly every. Oh, hang on. No, nope. let's get coin collecting cats penny in the pot. And you'll go on the board as well. But a massive thank you to everyone that's been so kind and generous as to write into the peer box. It does blow my mind some of the things that you sent even though it's just the kind words um, I'm absolutely gobsmacked by um, and a massive thank you to all because you absolutely do make my day going through all these items hang on we've got more pennies from the year 2000 from coin collecting cat so let's get those in the pot as well as I was saying a massive thank you to you all because you do absolutely do make my day go being able to go through all these I feel very honored and privileged to be in the position where you guys want to write into me and uh, say these kind things so a massive thank you to you uh, but also a massive thank you to those of you that support the videos by watching them liking them commenting message me on social media wherever it happens to be um, it, it, it genuinely does warm my heart um, so a massive thank you to you all I hope you've enjoyed this video this is now me all up to date post uh, Benj oh, prior to the Benjamin Bunny giveaway I've got all the postcards and they will all be drawn so from here on out will be all new stuff that have been sent into the peer box so massive thank you to you all I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time for more coins bye <laughs>